This is the EFCO TDO3 portable lathe. The TDO3 is capable of both radial and axial feed. With multiple tooling options, this machine is capable of boring and facing. In many applications such as valve seat repair, pressure seal repairs, removing broken studs, cylinder repair, and many others. Today we will be demonstrating a valve seat repair on a consolidated steam safety valve. First, to set up the TDO3 on the valve, the mounting ring is bolted to the body and the adjustable mounting legs are attached. This is one of several mounting options available. To center, adjust the four centering screws around the machine collar. To level, adjust the legs by lowering or raising the adjustment sleeve. Next, attach the dial indicator to the turning shaft and adjust for level using the adjustable legs. Then center the machine to the valve seat using the four centering bolts. Again, by removing the motor, the turning shaft will spin freely. For this seat repair, we will use the 4-inch boring bar with the 45-degree tool holder and a carbide insert. The tool bit is then lowered in to the seat and to the seating surface. The TDO3 is then started and the speed adjusted. Next, manually feed the machine axially for depth and radially to reface the valve seat. By using the digital readout, depth of the cut can be measured. The same operation can be applied to the seat step. Once complete, the consolidated steam safety valve is now ready to lap the seat. For this, we'll use the FCO TSV150. This is the EFCO TSV150, designed for lapping valves. This type of safety valve is ideal for the TSV. First, place the valve into the three jaw chuck, which centers the valve to the machine. Next, attach the correct size lapping disc to the spring-loaded spindle. Different grit abrasives can be applied to the lapping disc to achieve the desired effect. We will start by using 800 grit abrasive and we'll work our way up to 1200 grit lapping paste. Twelve hundred grit lapping paste will now be applied to the lapping plate. Pressure can be increased or decreased by adjusting the micro switch and the rotational speed is adjusted with the air control knob. This micro switch is used to adjust the amount of pressure being applied to the seat. As you can see, a mirror finish has been achieved by using the TSV150. We now have a successful repair of a steam safety valve using the TDO3 portable lathe and the TSV150. The valve can now be assembled and is ready to test. EFCO has many types of test benches available for all of your testing applications. Please contact us at EFCO USA.